playing. always my calling. Baby, I'm your man. My siblings and me would jam the night away. He's a drummer and she's a keyboard player. I was the guitar, songwriter, singer guy. We didn't know anything, like we were just, I was probably 14 or something and my mom didn't know anything, it was a music business and she wanted to help me so sometimes she'd pretend to be a different person on the phone and you know, would call up and, and pretend, you know, to hype me up and all this stuff and uh, it, sometimes it worked, sometimes it didn't. If you want strength, girl, I can give it. We would play like probably 100 shows a year through our teens. We were playing every weekend at different festivals and fairs. If you want a strong heart and a biggest fan, baby, I'm your man. Mm, yeah. I heard about Nashville and I knew I needed to move. I went down to my little uh, 95 Civic and uh, my guitar and some clothes and forever <laughs> and if you want that well, baby I'm your man you know you, you write a whole bunch and you hope that you just get a few that are gems you know and I mean the rest will probably end up being space junk you learn what to do and what not to do at the same time along the way we just recently got out of the studio after I, I found Eric Silver, my now producer, and uh, we had a great musical collaboration. I can't complain. I mean, I love my job. I love what I'm doing. It is uh, my lifelong dream. Then I'm your man. <laughs>